we're gonna go over 10 things you need to know about mortgage payment deferral programs. Let's do this. How's it going? My name is John and I am a mortgage broker located in Canada and welcome to another video. If this is your first time here and you wanna learn ways to be approved for mortgage, home buying tips and other mortgage related stuff, start now by subscribing and clicking on the notification button so you won't miss anything. Ever since COVID-19 was deemed a pandemic, many Canadians have been laid off. Good news is banks are working with the government to help you get through financial hardship by deferring your mortgage payments. Here are 10 things you need to know about mortgage payment deferral programs. Number one, they're discretionary. Lenders maintain the legal right to timely repayment of their mortgages. Mortgage payments deferral programs are offered at their sole discretion. They treat each customer on a case-by-case -case basis, so there's no fixed guidelines to whether or not someone qualifies. Number two, no lender is going to forgive your mortgage payment. A deferred payment program allows you to roll a defined number of mortgage payments into your mortgage. It's not a mortgage payment vacation. You still need to pay all the money you owe with interest. The payment will most likely get rolled into your mortgage, so you'll eventually pay it when you sell your property or pay out your mortgage. Number three, you must be able to demonstrate true financial hardship. It's understandable to be freaked out when it feels like the whole world is falling apart, but being worried about the future isn't enough to qualify for deferred mortgage payments. These programs are for people who are genuinely struggling to make their next mortgage payment. They've lost their job or a good chunk of their income, and they don't have reserves to draw on. If you're not in this group, you aren't likely to be eligible. Be prepared to submit a detailed breakdown of your personal assets, income, and expenses. Number four, if you don't fall into this distress category, please don't call your lender right now. Lender phone lines are jammed at this moment. A lot of calls are from people who are worried, but not in truly desperate situations. If you still got your income and have enough money to make your next payment, Delay your call to your lender for a couple of weeks or call whoever helped you set up your mortgage. Be prepared to wait on the phone lines for a long time. Stay calm, take a breath, be patient. It's stressful for you and for the person on the other line. Or think of other ways to get in touch with your bank, such as email or through your bank's mobile app. Number five, deferring mortgage payments won't hurt your credit score. A lender approved deferment is not counted as a missed payment and it won't appear on your credit report. They may need to pull your credit bureau, which may decrease your credit score, but your credit score will not go down because of any missed payments. Lenders are also generally offering to waive any fees associated with these programs during the COVID-19 crisis. Number six, deferred payment programs are typically capped at six months. Deferring the first payment will be easier than deferring the second one, and so on. Right now, six months is the longest reprieve you should expect. Number seven, communication is key. If you're about to miss a payment, call first. Be honest about your situation and have a plan for how you are going to get back on track. If you are about to miss a payment and can't get through on the phone lines, send your lender an email. Lenders will often waive NSF fees if you miss a payment but can demonstrate that you try to notify them in advance. Number eight, mortgage payment deferred programs is for your mortgage payment only. Property tax installments and insurance premiums are entirely separate from these programs and must continue to be paid. If your city and insurance companies offer similar programs, they should be contacted separately. Number nine, other options are often available. In addition to rolling payments into your mortgage for a specified period of time, lenders also have the ability to refinance your mortgage to pay out other debts the subject to qualification, lowering your payment by extending your amortization back to what it was when it started, hold a payment, or offer you a reduced payment for a specific time. Just a side note that interest-only payments on a standard mortgage aren't available. Number 10. Rental property investors may also be eligible. Property investors with tenants who have stopped making their rent payments will also be considered and they will be assessed by the same rigorous standards. 
Please note that some provincial governments have introduced tenant relief programs. Rental property owners can also encourage their tenants who have been adversely impacted by COVID-19 to apply for these programs if available. And there you go. We have just shared with you 10 things you need to know about mortgage payment deferral programs. Please remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel to learn more and make sure you click on the notification button so you won't miss a video. I'm John Lee, mortgage broker and CEO of Arise Mortgage. We are always achieving your approval.